LAV and Abrams joining their AAV. And they're doing try to do some target practice. <laughs> oh my god, they can! <laughs> what a freaking <laughs> shot! Are you kidding me? Unbelievable! That was incredible! <laughs> hey guys, Moidog here, and today we've got another episode of Eye in the Sky, where we take a look at a game of squad from the top down. And this one, we have the Russian VDV up against the US Marines. This is Black Coast RAS V1. And with the Marines and the VDV, we have two extremely amphibious capable forces slugging it out in one of squad's largest maps. Now we've had a couple of infantry heavy games in Eye in the Sky lately, but despite this map being uh, pretty much hard carried by the vehicles, no matter which side you were on, each team would have not been able to do anything if it wasn't for the infantry slugging it out on the objectives. As you guys can see, there's a lot of fun vehicle battles, but plenty of good infantry skirmishes and firefights, including some really clutch squad leader moves. So I think you guys will absolutely love this one. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and drop me a comment below with a map, game mode, or faction you'd like to see in the next one. And don't forget to check out the live streams over at twitch.tv slash Moynog, where I stream throughout the week. But that's it for me. Enjoy the video. Peace. All right. I in the sky... USMC up against the VDV. We are on board with the VDV for Black Coast RAS V1 with a bunch of their BMDs, a BMD 4M, which is like a BMP3, just amphibious. BMD 1M, which is like a BMP1, but amphibious. But boy, both of those are already amphibious. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's just, it looks different a bit. Yeah, different. New with the lightly armored BTRs. They got a T72 in a, in a five minutes. The BTR ZD, which is the AA vehicle, um, and then I, I'm surprised that the uh, the airborne forces don't get their helicopters just yet. But in a minute they'll spawn in. Also the Sprut anti-tank uh, vehicle. Um, USMC gets M1A1, which will spawn in in five minutes. Their tank, a couple AAVPs. These have the uh, grenade launchers and the 50 cal. Lab 25s, a uh, couple Humvees, uh, an AAV Lodgy, and a regular Lodgy. Black Coast is a big, big map. First point for, uh, actually we'll start up here. First point for USMC is logging camp over to Kalinovka and then all the way over to Quarry and then all the way over to Sablia and then down to Torpedo and then all the way over to Chernikov and then all the way to Pipeline. Um, yeah, I, I, this is either going to be a fantastic map or it's going to be an absolute route. Um, the the zigzag uh, back and forth can be extremely chaotic, but with helicopters and amphibious vehicles, hopefully you can you can move left and right of this uh, right. <laughs> of this little bay. What do you call this? Is this a bay? I'm gonna be I'm gonna be your freaking plug a hole in this shit force QRF. So let me know where you want me to go. This is eleven. I'll be airborne. <laughs> I like it. I will say one thing that we have right now is good comms. Go straight to their main. And we have the Sprout. He's about to have a lot of fun that. here with some target practice. Yeah. As a Hummer. Whoa. Oh, he flipped. Humvee flipped. And that's just, oh, you, hey, I hate to see it. <laughs> oh, man. Marines slam right into the rocks. Should and I uh, end up in the, uh, probably one of the worst uh, positions, was especially how fast. Oh, and man, they were about to just try to make a beeline up to this main road here. You see, it was a hat crew. Really good little uh, uh, disruption. Some, some you have a, a Humvee, combat engineer, and a, a heavy anti-tank all rolling together. So nearly, nearly pulled it off. Uh, but good, good shots by the Sprout. And as we get that started, we now have helicopters are live. We have, what, AAV stuck out in the middle of the water somewhere, and then helicopters. Ooh, both helicopters. Nine, VDV on our left, here. USMC on our right. And we see, I think they had the door gunners firing at each other too. USMC, do they have quarry? Yeah, yes. they do have quarry as one of their, uh, actually the third point for yeah, himself. So trying to get in all barracks. Not a, not a bad position to be in. Oh, man, they are coming in kind of hot. 
a little aggressive on the dismount, but USMC able to drop off an entire squad on Quarry. and Or not on Quarry, it's the second factory area north of Quarry. So very good uh, aggressive fob for them here. Um, and they should have some good map presence. Logging camp secured by the VDV. Kalinovka right now is uh, being capped by uh, VDV as well. And both sides, I'm actually... Yeah. Hold on a second. The Golden Potato, is he trapped on the bridge? Squad 6 has managed, for VDV, has managed to just rush this city at Chernikov. And because of that, uh, the AAV, which this is... Maybe they had a crew member get tracked and he's just stuck now. But that is going to be a huge pain for the USMC. They are only down... They only have captured one objective right now. And a forward deploying Squad 6 is going to that might be uh the point where we look back and say the game was won because usmc just could not capture the objectives uh we have we turn this on here we have our nice little anti-tank crew from off. earlier kind of watching the russian vehicles move well, off in the distance but they're not able to do much because uh, we just have a big armored presence north and you have, you can see one LAV south of us, another one south as well. So, squad three and six, I like this. Very often you have vehicles. Okay, got it. Take me to, take me to my move mark. Oh, hold on a second. That is the BTR ZD. That is the anti-aircraft BTR. And that, that Huey is the not looking good. He is going down fast. Right now. Heavy armor. You don't have to and Huey might be slamming into the trees here. Trying to touch down to put that fire out. Smoking and crash Pilot is really trying to touch down softly. You got to give him credit for that. And he managed to touch down. Can he get the fire out in time? Oh, he he's trying. Yeah, he did. And he's he's. You got to give that pilot credit. I mean, you have a bunch of Russian vehicles swarming these guys right now. Yeah. He's only going to survive for maybe another 30 seconds. He does put the fire out. What a play. Manages to save the helicopter, at least for now. And he might yeah, be able to completely get out of there. Yeah, but we yeah. have a couple BMDs on the south side. And BTRZD tries to do another burst of anti-air fire. And he's on fire again. Oh, yeah, no just barely. Nice work. There you go. I mean, you got to give both sides credit to that. The BTR ZD able to set up in a good position for the anti air. And I mean, that helicopter, that's. I'll go check it out if there's any infantry. I'm that was as, as good as you could have been right there. We got a yeah, yeah, over here on turn to call. 11. Do we need All right. In the meantime, Kalinovka has been secured by squad three for D VDV. And now you have uh, squad 11 has been forward deployed yeah, by the helicopter to start pushing quarry. Okay. Chernikov Electric. This is the second point. Oh, wait. Lucky and Golden Potato have snuck around. That is unbelievable. They have somehow... Oh, no. Hold on. They they have two AAVs. So you have one AAV with Hunter and Eric keeping uh, this side distracted. And then you have Squad 1 with Lucky and Golden Potato. Lucky living up to his name. He somehow got all the way around. And USMC might now, might now be able to stealth cap... Uh, Chernikov, and they really need to. Quarry's going to be captured soon, and that means you're going to have three objectives secured to one in VDV's favor. Um, we're going to let this side... Uh, these LAVs, honestly, they're being... I'm, I'm not saying that Squad 2 um, cannot be ambushed. You know, they are in, the, I think, the BMD-4, right? They are in the BMD-4. Uh, and LAV 25s, I mean, if they pounce on them, should be an easy kill for the BMDs. But I don't like how right now they're all playing World of Tanks off by themselves. Uh, T-72, Squad 12 has that out. M1A1 as well, so you now have a big armored column. And just as I say that, I think we're going to get uh, LAVs getting some nice little payback. For this anti-air BTR, anti-air BTR doesn't realize just around the bin he's got an entire marine armor column, but he might be just quick enough if he swaps to his gun. This anti-air gun can tear into the lab, but he's not going to see it. LAV's got him in his sights. Is he even paying attention? There you go. And this lightly skinned BTR is going to have nothing else to do other than just accept it. Right, me up to the 
west. Marking. And there you go, LAVs. Uh, seven. We're gonna join on some mines in the in front. At least a little bit of uh, revenge. Sorry, repeat. And squad eight goes down Gonna with his ship. So now you have a whole armored column on the north side. Uh, this south is south. also dangerous Bradley's because on. if we Bradley's take a look, uh, Damn, we take a look east there. or south rather. We have mines, combat engineers, whole armor. So and this is pushing towards. I, you know, some people might say, "Hey, you're not playing the objective." I mean, you're not even main camping yet. It's the main road. This is probably where a lot of the the vehicles are going to show up at, but this is very much in play. Second objective in Kalinovka. Quarry is being captured right now, and finally, Lucky and Golden Potato have uh, back-capped Chernikov. So, um, a little slow start for the USMC, but I don't know. Maybe this ball of armor. I mean, this is a lot of the Marines. I, once again, I, I don't necessarily like that they're kind of playing this world of tanks, run around uh, off of the objectives and run head first into a vehicle and see what happens but I've seen crazier things work out <laughs> all right so uh quarry oh and here you go this was that the Marines you know how we saw them earlier Marines hot dropped onto the factory north of quarry they've actually uh, VDV squad 11 has found that hab and radio they have overrun the fob so now the first uh oh there you go lav has just shown up and he's going to cause a whole bunch of problems knocks out one lobby he doesn't see the vehicle and a tandem round nearly slams in the infantry behind him lav popping some drive smoke and this is a perfect use of it <laughs> LAV nearly pulls it out, back from the west side. <laughs> but he does take at least that one AT shot, which means he's got to get out of there, already smoking, very lightly armored, and now you have, oh, you have the, this is a, a flank of flanks, I don't, I don't know, I'm curious, do you guys like this play or not, you, you have a giant ass flank by the, uh, is that an accurate tank mark? No, it's not. I think that's uh, I'm lucky he didn't see me. But I I I, I kind of get it. The issue that I'm seeing here is that you are you are flanking. Oh, okay, we do have some infantry still alive here. This is Marine infantry that have been left over. Caught in a few fights over that factory quarry fob. Um, but you now have uh, its quarry right over to Sablin. Okay, we're, we're coming. And it's just, it's a very tough position right now if you're you're the Marines. And I, I don't know if this this vehicle play is going to come to fruition. Uh, let's get some infantry action because Squad 5 for the USMC is desperately holding on to Quarry. And if they can, Torpedo Factory is now being secured by, I believe, Lucky and Golden Potato earlier. If they're able to capture a Torpedo, you got USMC next to Sablia. And then you can uh, contest Quarry. So, right now. very, very important fight right here. Well, could you resupply us in this southwest fob? We're going to try to get a lab building us. What is it? Okay. Well, one's an AAP, the other one I don't know. I just heard it for a trying to push second. in. He's got a whole bunch of friendlies down around him. Russians all inside. Just yes. Copy. So no support. Both Sabaya. try Sabaya. and Curse Sabaya. nearly Sabaya. pulls it off, but Point. neutral able to knock him out, and this might be Oh, hold on a second. You got Bert and Pollock now. Take it. Keep marking the the armor vehicles best you can. We're almost there. This this right to watch the guy shoot move. It's track. And hold right on a now. second. Should be low on ammo. Oh, you're you're getting Copy. these guys coming up and around to try to flank, and they're gonna run right into that transport. But unfortunately, I see him now. Do we want AA truck on west or east side of the USMC, map? USMC, yeah, there you go. Uh, USMC. Uh, moving I, I'm east. surprised that they're able to do this. They just captured uh, torpedo factory. Sadly, it's going down. 
I I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna call it. I think uh, I think VDV is gonna fumble this. I, I think they're gonna, uh, gonna six, they're gonna screw this up. Because if you notice, um, the VDV is kind of scattered right now. You you have a couple uh, USMC capping a torpedo. You also have a cup. I don't think the infantry is spawned just yet on the map. Uh, the way that squad maps work, if you're too far, you actually won't Commander, see any okay. infantry um, from the... Oh, hold on yeah, a second. We're good. We rush and this armored column is right. rolling right into this main. And, oh, they don't even have any AT. Is it safe for having to come in? Yeah, now? here you go. Now is there's a USMC. It? Big USMC so presence on the... Sablia. And Sablia... I heard uh, Sablia? Yeah, I can't even say it. Yeah, I heard a, um, heard a big, big boom. <laughs> Sablia might, might be... Yeah. Guys, the turning point, runs. capture that, and the USMC can all ball up into quarry. Really fast. I should get a hat gun and turn a cough while we can. LAV and Abrams joining their AV. They're going to try to do some target practice. <laughs> oh my god, they can! <laughs> what a freaking shot! Down, Are you kidding me? Unbelievable! Yeah, that was incredible! <laughs> uh, sure. no I cannot believe that shot. Not that I know of. Okay. <laughs> Jamshi, GVS, Taylor, and Lucky with the shot of the century there. Um, there you go, and it is now. Sablia are pushing back up. Any idea why the uh, AA truck just failed to spawn in? Any fixes? And here you go. <laughs> oh, there it is. Hand him round out from the west side. And now you aggroed all the vehicles and rip out there. That's a good shot. RPG trying to do a little bit more damage. You got one track. It looks like he also might be engine. That was a hell of an AT shot. Rip around the We're backside. And tandems, go. the LAV. So now both of these vehicles are actually incredibly low health. With our bastion. And just they have just that. a little bit of, uh, you know, one more RPG into the LAV 25, and it's going to be Dunzo. Lucky and Bissin Man trying to get the tank up. They're going to say LAV is going to be the casualty. Patty is on fire. Then, oh, trying to get back and repair, but takes a grenade. And Patty is going to go down. Armor push ends up in one vehicle being destroyed as you now have a defensive smoke push out and LAV goes down. Second uh, armor push. You see Humvee and LAV also coming down the main road. Another defensive smoke. And you have a whole bunch. And they got mortars as well. I mean, this is... They're treating this like the next objective. Oh, my goodness. This might actually be horrible. So, infantry for the USMC are pushing north into Kalinovka. It's not the next objective. The next objective is Quarry. And you have Russians pushing from the south into Sabli. Uh, Sablia. You actually might have so many Marines push north into an into a no non-existent objective or non-active point that uh, Russians are just going to come up right from behind. I'm pretty salty out there. You shot me down. I'm not pretty salty about that. Ooh, E72 and BMD. Oh, that's a yeah, Sprout rather. No, BMD4. Sprout. It is Sprout. We got the giant vehicle and they just absolutely destroy a Lodgy. Humvee as well is up. And the tank. Huge, but you push south of Kalinivka. You can see all this infantry. I'm not sure why they're even pushing it. We don't know that now you can point. see helicopter. They finally decided that we need to get out of here and yeah, try to push. Yeah, 
see all the infantry hopping in that Huey. Trying to get out of Dodge. The enemy helicopter is landing behind him. They might be trying to get a cheeky repair station fob or something for those uh, Russian vehicles. Squad 4, Squad 12, can you shoot that heli down that's uh, scouting us? Is that tank still in Kalinovka? And helicopter Rally. might be safe. Hey, four, can you come over to us? So we've got some ammo. And they're going to be good to go vehicle. here. Tank yeah, is just please. north of I us repairing. Um, okay, but we just marked it. LAV. Want to miss this here? LAV is trying to flank around an Guys, ambush. Not this is not objective. This is in. This is an in incredibly like ambitious flank. Oh, tandem so round like just misses. Hits the dirt behind the LAV. Tanks behind us, 12. And there, oh, this is a bad. LAV. Swap it around, trying to get the Sprout. Sprout knocks out one shot. And he's actually smoked himself. Oh, and RPG just misses as well. LAV is going to keep firing. Tandem round finally lands in. Oh, it's not going to do anything. Sprout trying to get a nice side shot. He's lost in the smoke. How is the LAV still alive? Another defensive smoke. Sprout is just deciding to bail out. T-72 is stationary as well, and now you have an LAV sandwiched in the smoke, as you can see him exit in a tandem, some type of AP, or, uh, ATG just smacked into the side of the T-72, and that might save him. Sprout's trying to back up and get an angle on the LAV, who's now stuck in the tree line here. Sprout, I don't know why the Sprout is being so passive about this. LAV is stuck. LAV is stuck, and the tank is now hit. Unbelievable. The Marines have no right to be even alive right now. Right now. LAV I has mean, caused the chaos. Take mark. Take mark. And now you have a tank. Oh, my goodness. And they're actually going to pull it off. Tandem round. There you go. Crewmen go flying. Turret pops. And the LAV-25... Causes enough chaos that puts both vehicles just in into, I don't know, some type of weird confusion. They The Sprout should have easily dealt with LAV, but now he has to get out of here. T-72 dies to tandem rounds, and... Alright, we'll try to come help you. Now you have the Marines. Their vehicles are just completely running riot on the north side. Come on, what do you need? Oh, and here we go. That is a, what, BTR? Or BMD? Pops a church, or pops a church. Pops a vehicle next to the church and the Abrams should have an easy kill here. Also, uh, where do you need it exactly? Abrams, gonna go right down Main Street and turn to see a nice, juicy Russian vehicle in front of it. And there you go, BMD4 straight ahead. Abrams misses his first shot. BMD has a chance. Yeah, swap to that cannon and does get one shot in the Abrams. I don't think it's gonna do anything. And there it goes, BMD tried. <laughs> At least they're in good spirits about it. A lost pet rock over comms. And the laugh, and we can't really do anything else at this point. You know what we haven't checked in on? The tickets. 249 tickets to 262. Russia is getting absolutely blasted right now. And uh, is down about 20 tickets. Even though they started off so well. One, two, three objectives for Russia. Three objectives now. No, four objectives for USMC. Unbelievable. You just didn't have enough uh, adjusting. And moving of infantry in order to get the... If you track that tank, I can it. In order to get the uh, infantry on the objective. So USMC have won, won the map presence now. Is that have in radio Definitely should not have accurate. happened. Uh, uh, a big, big infantry blob run into e each other just south of Sablia right now. And we're going to see there's this BMD-1, which he's just kind of just kind of chilling there. We're going to let him be because this infantry, I, I, I am shocked right now at the level of confusion that one LAV push was able to manage as Dubzilla okay, finally starting to limp his vehicle away. 
You have a bunch of Russian infantry nearby. And there you go. Abrams down the road. LAV like trying to limp away. Limp in. It is right beside you. Honestly, they just had any type of AT. Oh, crewman jumping in. Oh, they. <laughs> oh, we just ran him over. He's alive. Oh, never. <laughs> All right. I, yeah. I mean, I didn't expect much, but. Uh, LAV try to get their second crew, and that just wasn't going to happen. And now you have Torpedo Factory. You now have a Russian FOB being resupplied just south of it. This is at Marine FOB North. Flank a Rooney. You might be able to get, I'm not sure. I rip. There you go. Rip coming around the backside with his heavy anti tank kit. And he's got a couple good targets to choose from. So the vehicles, they're desperately trying to get through this main, this kind of kill zone uh, in this little tiny village. The issue is you have infantry that are so close uh, that they're kind of just peppering the vehicles. And as they whoops, actually slipped my hand off there, uh, as they're peppering the vehicles, they're not able to really get back to the repair station. Tandem round now going to be pulled out for Russian heavy anti-tank. And he's got the big boy tandem round into the backside of the Abrams. And there it goes. And he's engined as well. Fantastic shot. He's going to have two. And he needs to want to reposition here. RPG lands in the front of the tank, and that's why you need a reposition. Decides to go in the same spot, and Rip gets ripped. As the Abrams is going to stay just Number barely nine, alive. RPG, RPG sent him to the front side. We took out the crewman to the Abrams. Nice so work. Jam Sheed was dismounted, sure, trying I'm to get that engine track. back up, and he was killed. Uh, now you have Lucky on top, also dismounting. This is what I'm talking about. There's just so much infantry nearby. I, I, I can't tell if either side is really pulling ahead here. It's just such a grind, even though the tickets have Russia, EDV down 195 to 135. It really could be anyone's game. And here you go. You got the AS Val Scout. He's using his AS Valas binoculars because yeah, that's how you do it in the VDV, apparently. Looks like seven's over here as well. What is this fob? Are you kidding? This? I mean, okay. I mean, I kind of get it. This looks like someone who would like, like you're trying to do it for a screenshot or something. We're gonna bring the APC help like when I used to make videos of like updates and stuff, I would like go out in the middle of nowhere and just build a fob, and I, you just you don't really care. You just want to. Try to get all the assets and oh my god there. another mg no, bunker no, right no, here this, <laughs> this is like yeah this is like a a moy three or four years ago trying to get a thumbnail well <laughs> i don't really uh oh and he died you set up and he's dead. okay mark. yeah well there you go There's mines that's happening over road. there uh yes but i'm commanding at the moment i'm gonna see if i could get our other guy on the point and let's see. Ooh, great shot. RPG comes in the backside of the AAV. He's going to shrug it off. These things have so much health. Um, and we're going to swap fights here for a hey, second. Guys that are here near quarry, man. They're on top of oh, hold on. Right Actually, now. no, never mind. We got b and Holding potatoes out here. Quick. BMD is uh, on the other you they side. I coming like two minutes ago. No one did anything. Mule in little play. He's stuck in it. If he can't get out, we're going to swap over here because you see the the massive attack from the... Yeah, we're going to go over there. So good little uh, standoff. Actually, USMC I'm holding on. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm going to say they're, they're holding on all because yeah. of their vehicles. It's very aggressive and clutch vehicle plays. Uh, I, I thought for sure we were going to get some 
uh, some nice kills and captures from the VDV side of Sablia, but it's just not happening. Corey is now going to be the main spot because if this goes down, then Russia is might get steamrolled. To, uh, Kalinovka. Use it on Corey. Do it. Uh oh. But I'm gonna need a flyover. Actually, more. Uh oh. <laughs> Just went over there. Hold on. Hold on to your butts. We're going fast. The Abrams is in a, such an odd situation. Just pops the BMD, but he might regret that. So BMD goes down from the Abrams, and there you go. That's why, because the tandems are on the other side. Smoke is all around. Infantry have ambushed this Abrams. You can see the engine is out. You got smoke coming out of the turret. You have crewmen just all around. You see him, he's trying to run back in. Oh, tandem, oh, that landed just low. It actually landed just below the tank. That tank would have died. Tandem round lands a little short, and because of that, kicks up a whole bunch of dirt. Tank is alive for one more round. You see Rip coming in close with that tandem round. LAV might save the day here. Tandem round, he has to loop it over the LAV into the tank. Focus on the tank. Abrams Nine should... No, focus figure. on the tank. Focus Back on the tank. Tandem round into the side of the LAV now. Area. LAV is going to be alive. AAV right. also comes in for support. Massive vehicle right. chaos right. over here. Oh, and hold on. Does he have an infantry bag? Yeah. Oh, he's a medic, actually. Tandem round. Yeah. Is it on fire? No, it's deflecting. Abrams is still alive. AAV is now trying to get in front of him and shield him. Like AAV point, is, like is, uh, oh, and he did, he shields him. AAV with a huge play just direction. takes the tandem round as the crewman on the backside tries to get the fire out. Oh, and the common engine might be able to pull it off. He's dropping the C4 as well. They don't realize. Oh, they're not going to realize there's C4. He's putting the C4 on. Oh, oh. No. No. They're not taking Corey right now. <laughs> Unbelievable. Can the tank pull it off? Crewman trying to put the fire out. He just put it on our entire team defending Corey. Okay. He might be able to pull it off. We'll be fine. We're in a hangar. Yeah, but it is everybody just, else there. Th this is if Fury happened Seven, in the year 2023 12. right okay. now. Crewman finally coming around. The crewman came from the backside, actually knocked out the, uh, I think this was Rip even, the, the heavy anti-tank coming around to try to finish off the crewman. Oh, and there it goes, finally goes down, tandem round. Just at the last, tank had just gotten fully repaired, and you gotta give him credit for the crewman. Lucky now. Popping in his uh, grenade launcher and trying to mop up the rest of the infantry. Going to double check to see if there's any Russian vehicles incoming. They are not. You have a BTR ZD way up north. But that is about it. LAV is, I think that's just on their spot. Yeah, LAV. And as, oh, I mean, this is just so devastating if you're Russia. 121 tickets, 161. You've been stuck. The amount, the amount of infantry that has just, <laughs> the amount of infantry that has just poured into uh, Sablia only to get pushed away by these vehicles has been absolutely insane. Huge plays by the USMC uh, defense, and as that's happening, uh, the Marines have decided to swap over to. Um, attacking, and this is a defensive artillery barrage. This is a Russian artillery barrage trying to stem the, the push from Corey. And you have a Squad 7 rally, and this is kind of where they're at, but Russians, they don't even have a Hab anymore. You can see Hab is being tried to dug up again by I'm Founder to do Cartman. A Eastern hab of, on Corey. Did I say Cartman? Cartman? Cart Cartman? Founder Cartman. Trying to use his super shovel up and get that uh, hab up, but Delta York might say no. I killed you. And, oh, there you go. Infantry coming from behind, and Delta York goes down. VDV need to hold on to this fob in order for it to... Uh, in order for them to not lose this objective. 
but now you see you got Ken, Nestor, uh, King, and MJ. They're starting to push in. Fritz to his south doesn't see him just yet. And Ten might rock, rock up right into a Fritz. Oh, Fritz swaps. He's bipoding, and he does get Fritz. Southwest building of Corey. You know what? We're kind of sieging them. A lost pet rock might be able to do just enough as we see Tin goes down, but a lost pet rock is actually with this tiny. Run, run. Look at look at what's We're happening here. A lost pet Sweating. rock what the fuck are you doing, has just <laughs> caught down to the eastern three habit, of these then. infantry in a building. Oh, He's kept them man. locked in there. Did you see me on the map? That's important because oh, well. you've had you now have enough infantry spawning in. Look at all the blue Wait, coming back in. Do. The blue is coming in right at the really? last, and although it might go really, neutral, really, Russia might be able to recap to this. Corey. It goes neutral, but only for just a second. As Tall Morty is now trying to breach. They wanted to do the same. <laughs> also, Tall Morty goes we in, might run right into Scrambled. Scrambles on the backside. Oh. And, oh, okay. oh! Actually able to get a shot off. One goes down, and it is neutral now. And that is a unbelievable hold for Russia. Yeah, it goes neutral, but I'm looking at the map and we're not seeing. Oh my goodness! Rock Nut has managed to find the radio, and probably because the hab is right next to the radio. So this was the attack fob. And support the other side of the river. And here you go. Russia is going to completely flip. As Sablia is also now going down, USMC have thing. now taken uh, defeat from so the Jaws weird. of Victory, and they might just lose yeah, this game. 106 not, tickets to 99 for the first time this game. Uh, hey, Russia hey, is actually in the lead. The VDV <laughs> now have a almost 10 down. ticket advantage. And let's take a look. Sablia has just not. I, I, I'm surprised that they they managed to have enough of a push. push but now forward, what you're going to have is all of the USMC, as we see now. Our they're ABC all spawning on the only health. hab they can, which is Sablia. And let's turn on the capture zone. So Fall Sablia back. is this yeah, one little one dome. You can thing. see it is all blue right now. you got a Should good push from the Marines the, uh, the on the course. northwest side, which is our uh, bottom right. And this is a good infantry push. Yeah, I'm need it, some you got Russian right, uh, infantry uh, trying to hold this one, church. One and you got friendlies dragging them in. You just got a whole graveyard of vehicles. as a BTR. Oh, grenade goes in the church. It bounces off the wall. But it doesn't matter. Is on the right, right sure, side, you actually have infantry yeah, trying to push. Yeah, and still one BDV left in. Yeah. He's going to pull out his bandage, try to heal. Oh, actually, he's going for a grenade, maybe? Side by side. Russia throws another grenade. Good USMC to trying to go around, around the backside and flank him. From the north of the glory, there's a half there. Oh! Did that just happen? No. <laughs> Nearly got him. He got handcuffed in his own bandages. And with that one push, infantry just overwhelmed the objective. And sadly, it should be flipping red. And it is... Oh, it's neutral, actually. Quarry is back to almost being secured. I can resupply the Northern Folk instead. And here we go. Russia. See if there's any vehicles that can come help turn the tides here. Uh, it is... Is the AVP moving? 66 to... Oh, wow. VDV have now lost... I think they lost a FOB because that's 66 tickets to 69. They lost 40 tickets extremely quickly. VVS Taylor knocks out Gunter. Um, uh, yeah, but we still have... We is it Weep Tile? Weep Tile down in the trenches laying on the back side of the church. But that's going to be starting to recap for Sablia. And it is. So we are back to square one. one 63 to 69. Nice. Tickets. And... USMC has managed to hold off on Quarry. I think you just need one more, one infantry swapped off the capture point. If Quarry is able to be secure, then. It's on our attack, Captain the South. 
It might just be whoever's vehicles okay. win the vehicle fights here. Infantry yeah, pushing in from the uh, east side now, which is our left. And VDV trying to get back into this objective here. Running through the trenches, an enemy straight to his front left. We've not Spot seen him just yet. Yes. Goes full that auto, finally the tags him in the uh, leg there. Scrambled goes down, unyieldy, just trying to hold on. you got a whole bunch. Fishy Dishy, Dubzilla, Jimmy, Pesto, Hundo, Special K, and... He's able to take out unyieldy infantry trying to hold on as we have a VDV hot drop coming in. And I'm, I'm wondering if they're trying to get a radio down. Well, it doesn't matter because AT just slams in the side of it. And he should be okay. LAV yeah. mops him up, and that is going to be incredibly important because that's 53 tickets to 57, but it also doesn't have the uh, the resupply capability, so might come back to haunt Russia, but Xander, Drunken Monk, Ton, they're pushing the main defense fob here, TX Bombero and Xander, they trade. We did. Now Lucky trying to hold the corner, AS Val. Somebody stay the, the scout rear. trying to push up. Oh, there you go. Oh, That's M27. God damn it, dude. Uh, going, yeah. <laughs> going full Thought auto and lucky just bitches. slowly Why pushing up the road. Losing radio on Corey. Losing radio on Corey. That's not going to be good. Lucky with a huge play again. He's knocked out two of the three. And he goes to the reload. <laughs> As Val pulls out this. You both dead? His weapon just in time, oh, and yeah. there you go. That, that was incredibly clutch. Oh, but as, as this radios. has happened, we're here and gotta save the radio. They're on the radio. the radio. And try to cap supply at the same time. <laughs> oh, it looks like this radio here is a Russian on the radio. radio at E911, if you could save it. They just got on it. E9. My, my E9. Oh, this radio down here. Hold on a second. It's the attack fob. 41 tickets to 40. As a Huey comes in for some resupply. We got mortars just south. We're just landing just south. The RPG slams into the side. And he's lost his engine? Oh my god, what an RPG shot. Lost the engine. How did he not lose his rotors? Are you kidding me? This is something wonky happening here. <laughs> it's already gone. Um, like this should, uh, something's not right. I'll just so say that. RPG. Catch him in on fire and he should pop. I mean, this should have been a, a, a nice uh, helicopter rotor kill. And it still might go catch on fire, but s oh, there you go. The 16 tickets to 30 as the to radio on M10. This radio goes down for 20 the, tickets. They, they did find it. There was a radio right on the. There was a rally right on the radio. Hey, my fucking line is flipped. All right, and it's gone. So just deal with it. Comms now are absolutely I, losing their mind, and this is why because you've lost one radio on the east side. And they've now lost another radio on the south side. And this is on bleed out. This is going to be the game. Radios are 20 tickets. This is the game. Russia have actually lost the game because they put too many fobs out. They, these are like all their fobs. They put them all around. And they weren't paying attention to them. Random Marines just stumbled in. There's a lat on that hab. And managed to dig one down, about to Who's dig another one down. Is 15 tickets, and sixes. it is all up to who's this? JK. Six You've got a gaggle Six. of Marines in here. 13 tickets to 24, and what he needs to pull out a way, massive, massive wipe here, and I don't think he's going to be able to do it. Sneakers of Tool Six? should see. Oh, hold it's on a close. second. Might be captured to buy in time. It's going to be real close. Knocks out one. And it's going to be close. And oh, GV, this Taylor able to do it. On it. He died on the objective. And that's it. 
22 to 0. As close as you're going to do it, one radio separating the team. And the USMC nearly lost it in the opening moment. Ends up winning it with a clutch 22 tickets, 180 kills to 196, 51 revives to 75. Also, that is, oh, that's the game right there. These revives out reviving them by 24 and you, you win by 22. There you go. Gee, geez.